you can access the Timer Pro ergonomic module, both from the video time study and from the balancing area. Here we are in the video time study area. What we do is we come up here to the drop down at the top left of the data collection area. This is going to be the current focus of our study. And I can click on this. And I can select the ergonomics option right here. If I do so, it will put ergonomics in here. It will also introduce a new column over here called Ergo. And here we have our activity where the operator is loading the cage. If we double click here, you can see this is an area where there might be quite a bit of ergonomic stress. And we might want to analyze this from the ergonomics point of view. So to do that, what we do is we go into the Ergo column and in the highlighted row, we just double click here and it will bring up the body map. And now you can play back the video from the body map screen and pause it when you see an ergonomic issue, say right there. And if I was doing that, that would not be good for my back. So I can click on the lower back here. You can see I've got no stress, light, moderate, severe. I might say it's severe in the back. He's reaching with his right arm. We give him moderate stress on the arm and hand. And because you get the video, you can see he's standing in one foot. You'd probably miss that if you're standing there with a pencil and stopwatch or an iPad. So we can pick that up right here. So here we've identified the basic body stresses. And over here, we have the ergonomic factors and the group list here. Everything you see here, you get to define. This is actually an Excel template. And we'll show you how you set these up and use them in a subsequent video. If I save this now, if I save this now, it will show the highest body stress here, which is on the lower back and the color, the red being the dangerous condition for the severe ergonomic status here. Now I can do the same thing if I go over to the balancing area, here's the same operation here. And all we do is come up here. We change our view from our default value added, non value added view to the ergonomics view here and the color of the bar changes. And then I can double click on the item I wish to review here. And exactly the same body map screen comes up. Again, I can do the same thing. Play the video back here. Pause it when I see an issue identify the various stresses that might be on the, the operator performing this job. And also down here at the foot. To fill in the areas over here, this is our standard group. So what type of stresses? I can say lifting, force, posture, twisting and turning, but not repetition, eye strain, temperature and so forth. What percent of the total video clip is under stress? I will say 50% here. And over here, then we get different categories. So if you look at the neck, here are various categories available to you. These are these defaults. You can change these any way that you want here. Mobility of trunk, perhaps you say, because he's leaning over like this, it's dynamic, 20 to 60 degrees. Body forces, you see many different options. You get to define all of these. These are just our default ones. And you can see here, more options. Standing, walking, sitting, and kneeling. Relocation of loads, which is what we're doing here. So what I can do is maybe scroll down here. Here I find my push and pull. So I might come in here and say the weight is 30 kilograms. This is prompting me for an entry. I could say this is a um, push and pull, a short one. It's bad conditions for the body posture. The conditions of execution are difficult. Position accuracy is low and the speed is slow. And the cart is exclusively used. I'll say yes. You could put notes in here needs help and could damage product. And then we can click on the print here from either area, either in the video module or the balancing area, it pops it right out here. And of course, the people can play it back directly from Excel here. So you can see exactly how you've analyzed the job from an ergonomics point of view. And when I save it, it highlights this activity. Again, being a dangerous condition, you can see all the body members here are in a dangerous condition here. So you can do it either from the balancing by going to the ergonomics and double clicking on the chip, or you can do it from the video module by changing the focus to the ergonomics here, and then double clicking on the item that you wish to review.